I'm David Geddes. I'm the Head of Primary Care Commissioning for the national team for NHS England. GP by background, um, I only do uh, that one day a week now. Uh, in essence, I suppose my, my message today at the conference was we are all leaders in this. This is not something that we can expect a, a top-down kind of approach to delivering care differently. There is a fundamental challenge for the NHS. Going forward, we've got to make some significant changes to how care has been delivered. And our current models of care are not fit for purpose. So we need to be creative. We need to make sure that we are getting true clinical leadership in that and driving that forward. And that means actually all our members of LOCs, our professions, we are the ones communicating with patients. We therefore got to make sure we are listening to what has been told to us and actually collaborate and work through some of those difficulties, some of those barriers, in order to make sure that the care and the pathway of care that's been delivered for patients improves. We're desperate to try and reduce the amount of bureaucracy that runs in the NHS. But actually, at the moment, we're having to sort of work our way through such a quagmire of different processes and principles to be able to get a system which is effective. The NHS England model is a bit, a bit elusive, a bit of a challenge to be able to sort of articulate clearly. I think the key message is NHS England is one organisation. It's one organisation which therefore should be able to provide some consistency and some transparency about how the work has been done. But actually, Although it's one organisation across England, we need to be able to identify the fact that there is a real need for localism in the NHS. It doesn't cut across that. It's all about making sure that local clinicians and local communi uh, clinical communities are working towards solving problems and identifying that issue. So NHS England, as a contract holder for optometrists, for example, and commissioning eyesight is only a small element of the eye health agenda. It's really important that the other element of commissioning, which is the CCGs and your local authorities, work together in order to be able to make sure that there is a collective view as to what the vision of clinical care is like in your community. And although there is an awful lot of focus on GPs, and clearly there's a real prominence in, in, the, in the legislation about CCGs and the roles of GPs in that, it is actually clinicians that are driving uh, commissioning. It's not just GPs. Key message from today, let's take risks. Let's not just assume that there is going to be someone else doing this. Let's recognise that it's a challenge and a challenge to deliver any kind of change in something so complex and so big as NHS. But let's be up for it. Let's do it with eager, eagerness and let's make sure that we are true to our values. Because actually the Health and Social Care Act is all about that. It's about making sure that the values, the clinical values that underpin the NHS come forward in how we commission and go forward with the organisation.